Well, it's primary election day here on the Sun Coast. The polls opened at 7 a.m., and that's when controversy began outside of a precinct on Longboat Key. ABC 7's Rebecca Vargas joins us now with more on the story. Rebecca? Well, Scott, a filled out ballot is given to a voter this morning before she casts her vote, and it doesn't sit well with a candidate. A woman sitting behind the Democratic Party table outside of Precinct 201 in Longboat Key allegedly hands a voter a filled out ballot suggesting who she should vote for. Standing near, near this table, the incident caught the attention of a candidate, Doreen DuPont, running as a Democrat for precinct committee woman. And she confronts the Democratic table's representative, claiming what she was doing was illegal. The voter tells me over the phone she initiated this conversation, asking for a recommendation for a couple of the races, but did not expect a filled out ballot. The supervisor of elections tells us any suggestions or campaigns at least 150 feet from the precinct entrance are not illegal, but are left up to the official parties to handle. The uh, Democratic Party is supposed to be neutral and they're not supposed to be telling people who to vote for because this is a primary. In the case of the ballot, they had uh, it filled in not to vote for me, uh, not to vote for Congressman Alan Grayson. It was filled out and I wasn't even aware of it. And then that woman came over and I just, she said, well, who are you voting for? Whatever. And she came and ripped it out and said, this is illegal. Now, the chair of the Democratic Party of Sarasota County says it is policy that those representing the party as a whole are not allowed to be behind a table representing the party and then giving recommendations or a filled out ballot. Scott, back to you.